Another approach, I killed the snow this time to give me a little better visibility. And it uh, definitely makes a difference when you can see the ground when you get close and the runway. Still nothing up at this altitude. Coming on to course. We're still left of the glide path. And uh, slightly off our glide slope. Localizer is live, moving back towards the center. Still, my heading is still a little right, of course. I'll adjust that shortly. You know, I did not get the actual magnetic heading for uh, the OBS here. I just used the runway designation, which is 07. So I could probably have made that a little more precise by getting the actual numbers. Now we're a little uh, above glide slope, so we're descending at an increased rate. Now we're on glide slope, and overshot that a little bit, I think, but I am slowing it. And this was a track. This is a track from a mission I just ran. So it's not live. Getting a little below glide slope. A little right of glide path. And I'll let that get a little away from me. But I'm able to correct and bring it back on. You can see the ground now. If you look straight down. Thing. Slightly above glide slope, right of glide path. Still don't have the runway in sight, but uh, Seeing the ground makes it a lot easier to control the aircraft. Coming back on glide path, on glide slope. Got a good descent rate, 500 feet, 370 AGL. Shot the uh, course a little bit, and now I'm above glide path, I mean glide slope, and we have the runway in sight. All right, let's slow this puppy down. And we're down. 